Senator Johnson. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Uh, let me start at the outset. I'm an accountant. Uh, I value audits. My wife was an IRS auditor. So, you know, we need that. There's no doubt about it, okay? You can argue legitimately, you know, to what extent, how many auditors, you know, how much we should spend on it. That's, that's legitimate uh, conversation. Uh, I, I do have to admit, though, every time I hear the chairman or the chairman of the Finance Committee say the word wealthy tax cheat, I think of the name Hunter Biden and all of the Biden family members who have been participating in his influence peddling grifts. I think it's interesting, as much as this hearing is emphasizing on audits, that when Senator Grassley and I were conducting our very legitimate investigation using our constitutional responsibility of oversight, when we were investigating tax cheating, influence peddling, you know, money coming in tens of millions of dollars from foreign entities to impact potentially U.S. policy, Democrat senators, our ranking members, not only frustrated, I would say obstructed our investigation by falsely claiming we were soliciting and disseminating Russian disinformation. Now, that just happened to parrot what we've now found out the FBI set up their foreign influence task force, what they were doing in their catch and kill operation, find derogatory information that was being developed by 40 confidential human sources and then go kill it. Go, go say, no, that's, don't, don't look into that. Go, don't, don't go down that investigatory hole because that's Russian disinformation. So the question I have based on that, Professor Saren, it's obvious 